So still working on this solar tank here and finding some leaks, getting that fixed. So I did shoot some video assembling one of these frames and uh, I'm going to backtrack a little bit and show you what happened there. So it comes with three of these long frame pieces and four of these shorter ones and uh, so this is like the cross bracing but actually primarily it's going to be used for for literally mounting it to the wall or wherever it's going and i uh, just going to show you here what it looks like in the corners so you can see there's a piece of angle here ready for bolts and uh, the bolts I'm just going to grab one here so these are these slots accept the bolts you can see it, it just slides right in there and once it's in there it doesn't want to really turn so it kind of stays in place as you tighten the nut and it doesn't want to turn with so uh, all four sides are the same so uh, these are really uh, nice uh, pieces for the structure so I got this request to say it's great mate and uh, but uh, the, the problem is when I say that it's like I, I think of like Australia and, and how they would say it. It's great, mate. And uh, it's almost hard to say it like I would normally say it. Mate. mate. It's great, mate. It's great, mate. So he's trying to, he's, he's trying to master my accent. So, uh, of course, uh, usually a guy never thinks he has one, but apparently I do. Okay, so I start sli sliding the bolts into the framework here. Sometimes I've forgotten to put enough bolts in and I've got to take it apart later and put them in there. So I'll try and do that first. You can see the short bolt right here. So these are uh, three of the longer ones and one short one. And that'll make a little more sense later why I'm doing that. So I'm starting to bolt the collector onto the three long frame pieces and that corner is already bolted down and uh, here you can see I've got a square that I'm using to square off the collector with uh, the outside frame piece here and then on the back side you can see that the collector is uh, or that the frame piece is extended past the collector just a little bit and that's the same thing on all three of those long frame pieces. So here's something I haven't shown you guys yet. It's a, it's a, it's a pretty nifty little clamp that they're using for this setup. So I'm just going to set this on there. And this thing I've got it set up. These frame pieces, they extend just far enough so that the clamp is flush with the end of that frame piece and you can see how that that clamp it sits on that little groove here of the collector and it gets right in there and then so and then on this side similar thing so here's a pre uh, pre-installed bolt that I put in there and same thing here slide that I'm sliding that clamp right up against it and uh, it looks reasonably square here so I can go ahead and tighten that down. Not sure if I mentioned this short little bolt earlier in the video but here's why I do that. So the bracket that I've been getting with these kits is uh, actually needs to be redesigned. These uh, bolt holes in the middle they're too close together so I'm going to just slide some bolts in there and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. You see how they interfere? But anyways, so I've got the one short one and this is what it looks like here in this corner. So you can see you can't even get a you can't even get a socket on these. The only thing I can use in this corner is just an open end wrench. So it is what it is. So up next I measured back from this top top of the frame piece, measured back and I made a little mark right there in that corner 
And I'm actually using this bottom piece that holds the cups later, I'm using that as a straight edge because I've got a mark here also. So I'm just going to make a nice mark here, here and there so that uh, I know exactly how to uh, square up the uh, frame pieces that go in between here. And uh, I came to this measurement based on uh, where it's going to be mounted outside. There's some give here. I mean, it doesn't have to be exactly where I have it. I mean, it can, uh, you know, there's some room there to move. Okay, so that's basically it. So now I've got these cross pieces in here and they're also going to be used to mount it outside. You can see I've got bolts installed and uh, same thing up there. So I won't be using all of these bolts but ideally you can mount these with a bracket here, here, there, there, a total of eight and uh, this is one of the brackets that goes outside so that gets fastened to the bottom here like to one of those bolts so this is an outside bracket and uh, this is the rail here that holds the cups that hold the uh, glass so you can see they've got kind of like little hooks on there so they just they, they insert here and uh, this is a threaded piece here that inserts into there. So in here once again I've just got these brackets just to the end of that framework and then uh, that should all work out for that glass to be uh, sitting in there in, in these pockets. Nice. Yeah, so this thing's pretty much ready to hang up outside.